So I've been amassing my uh, RC quad um, stuff lately, and I'm trying to get into quad um, flying and FPV and things like that. Um, so one of the things that I've purchased is this uh, Q6 smart charge from ISDT, got it from Banggood. Um, and I just saw a video right now um, that was put out by Ladrib, Drew, um, really quality stuff, but he just got the same thing. And I was already figuring uh, I'm going to have to maybe buy another power supply or, or something of that nature to get this guy up and running since it runs on uh, these XT60 connectors um, that it comes with. But he bought a spare Xbox 360 um, power supply. And in my spare parts stuff, I have an Xbox 360 power supply so I need to go up there and get that down and see if I can do the same thing 360 power supply but the issue is um, it is an old style it doesn't look like the one that Drew had did so when I cut this guy off I'm sure I'm gonna find a lot more wires than what I really uh, had intended so it looks like I'm gonna need to go and find some instructions on how to do this so sure enough googled in lie you know red and blue wire I'll short these guys out and then combine these two um, and um, create some new connectors and get this guy going so Not high yet. To be continued. Alright, I'm sure people will tell me what I'm doing wrong here. It's a gobby mess. Okay. So yeah, I don't do this um, very often at all. Ugh, I'm horrible at this. I guess if I'm getting into FPV and stuff, I better step up my game. That's horrible. I'm going to leave that in there. You know why? Because someone's going to thrash me and I'm going to get better at it. So. so let's just assume that went well and I had no problems whatsoever. Agree? Okay. Got this squared away. Now I'm going to work on that connector. I think the way to do this, and here we go with my shoddy soldering skills. More stuff to be edited out. All right, so from my understanding, we just fill this thing up. Do the same thing over here, and then I'll tin the wires. Hopefully, that's good enough. Gob it on. All right. All right, moment of truth. So here is my connector. I'll plug this guy in first. And I should see, according to this, a green LED off of this guy. If green. All right, so the short is correct. Now, without electrocuting myself, I'm gonna plug this guy in. Oh yes, I got it working. That's all I needed to do. All right. Now I'll just clean this guy up and... Okay, so even though I am not very good at the whole 
soldering and making connections and heat shrink and all of the above this should let the average person know that even if you have pretty limited skills such as mine you can create something like this so now all I need to do is wait for Amazon to deliver some batteries and I will charge them no clue beyond that I hope that helped uh, someone get a little bit further on there obviously there's way better tutorials but like I said if if I'm able to get this done then uh, you know your average person is going to be able to get this done as well so I think that's uh, that's saying something Anyways, thanks for watching.